Okay class, let's continue with the video. I was checking my book, no? It was where that I couldn't see this activity and I check and I watch the activity. Look, here is the next exercise, it's a lot. But here I have the answers, no? It says, rules to form questions. Remember, this topic is about questions. In the simple present, B, use question words plus form of B. What am um, is R? Remember present. In number two, in the simple present, use question word plus do or does plus a verb. What do you, what does she? Number three, in the present continuous, use question words plus form of B. am um, is R plus the verb plus ing. In the simple past, use question words plus dead, plus verb. And finally, in the simple past, B, use question words plus was, where. Remember, we're going to create questions, no sentences. Okay, here it says, read and put in order. Uh, I'm going to give you a tip. When you have this kind of exercises, sometimes the first word is in capital letter. What is capital letter in Spanish? Mayúscula. So automatically I say what? No? We have verb plus ing. Uh -huh. What? You? Or are? Are. What are you doing? Opinions classes? Yes, what are you doing? Okay. Number two. Mister, but there are two words with capital letter. Hay dos palabras con mayúsculas. Yes, you're right. Remember, the day of the week or the month of the year, we use capital letter. Okay? But we started with question word. No? Question word. What, where, when, etc. In this case, where? Where you Sunday last where? Aha, uh -huh. where were you Sunday or last? Last Sunday. Continue. Three. Best your friend who? With capital letter and is the only one. Okay. Who? Continue. Could be do or does, could be did, what, was, where, am, um, is, are, are. Perfect. Who are? Class, continue. Who are your two, okay, best friends? Well, this question is going to be like impossible because you only have one best friend. Okay, well, if you have to, there's no problem. Number four. Number four. Get up. Oh, sorry. You, this, it, what? What? With capital letter. Okay, what? Let's see. You, this, it, did. Uh huh. What did you what did you, and you continue with the verb, uh -huh. what did you eat for breakfast this morning or morning this, this morning, okay, you are right, five, get up, do on weekends, you, when, when is with capital letter, so I start here, when, get is a verb, get up, do, is the auxiliar, uh -huh. when do you, perfect, when do you get up on weekends, and six, where on vacation, how long, uh -huh. teacher, but how long to work, yes, how long is like, cuanto tiempo, okay, how long, where you on vacation, okay, Hope there is no mistakes. One, two, three. Well done, class. No? 
Okay, here I have the first three questions. What are you doing? Where were you last Sunday? Who are your two best friends? You can pause to, to, your, uh, to write the answers on your book. I continue. For what did you eat for breakfast this morning? When do you get up on weekends? How long were you on vacation? Okay, you can stop the video and you can complete. I continue, okay? Thanks. So, we are here. No? Let's see about vocabulary. It says collocation with time. So, in this, in this activity, you're going to check about words related with time. Okay? For example, let's read. Mary, Capitan and Co. spends or brings a lot of time helping other people. Don't waste or don't lose your time. You have a lot of homework to do. I never keep or I never find to relax and read a book. We had or we took a great time at Sandra's birthday party. I'm sorry to hear you're having or spending such a bad time. She loves painting in her extra or spare time. He's so busy, he can never take time away or take time off. Okay, let's see. Here I have the activity. Okay, this is your moment. Talks about Mary Kapitanenko. It means that there are some answers there. Okay, Mary Kapitanenko spends or brings a lot of time so i'm going to help you so some students can say teacher or mister spends money yes that is good but there's also spend time you can spend time with your friends okay spend time helping other people so in this case it spends number two don't Waste or lose your time. You have a lot of homework. Waste and lose. Waste means desperdiciar. Lose means perder. So in this case, the correct word is uh, waste. Okay? Okay, let's see if you remember the words because we, we seen these activities, okay? I never... I never keep or I never find great time at Sandra's birthday party. Huh? Number three. I never sorry, I, I was confusing. I never keep or find time to relax and read the book. Fine. No? Okay. We had or took. Look this. Uh, answers are in the past so need to be careful the present is half the present is state we had a great time or we took a great time had we had a great time at Sandra's birthday party now let's see I'm sorry I hear you you're having or spending such a bad time spending or having having so, but teacher, mister, in the first one you say spends about time, yes, a lot of time or spend time. In this case, it's not exactly the time, it's the, the, the moment. So, in this moment, you are terrible because you don't have a good time. So, you are having such a bad time, such a terrible time. So, you have problems maybe, so you have such a bad time, okay? Or in this case, having. She loves painting in her extra or spare time. Spare, okay? Spare. It's like free time, okay? No extra time. He is so busy. He can never take time away or off. Time off. Now, let's see. One, two, three. Perfect. Mary Capitanenko spends a lot of time helping other people. Don't waste your time. 
you have a lot of homework to do. I never find time to relax and write a book. We had a great time at Sanders' birthday party. I'm sorry to hear you're having such a bad time. She loves painting in her spare time. He's so busy, he can never take time off. So, it's, for example, today, those days we can use, uh, for example, uh, the teacher spends a lot of time making virtual classes. Why making virtual classes? Because of coronavirus, we're in quarantine, so we can go out, we can go to school, no? Don't waste your time, you have a lot of homework to do. Class, don't waste your time. You have a lot of activities to do. I never find time to relax and read a book. Now you can say, I always find time to relax and read a book, no? Today you are in your house, you don't go to school, you do your activities, and you have time, no? We had a great time at Sandra's uh, birthday party, okay? We had a great time at our meeting in Google Classroom, okay, or Meet. I'm sorry to hear you're having such a bad time. I'm so sorry to hear you, you're having such a terrible time. You, I don't know, you had an accident, you lose your job, you forget to do your homework, no? Different ideas. She loves painting in her spare time. She loves cooking in her spare time. She loves, uh, I don't know, she loves uh, writing poems in, their, in her spare time. No, that's the idea. He's so busy, he can never take time off. Yes, the teacher is so busy, he can never take time off for relaxing, for example, no? Take time off is like, take a break. Like descansar in Spanish. Okay? Good. Now let's see. Here I have the last activity. And we're going to do this in our virtual class. Okay? So uh, this video is uh, almost uh, ready. Yo, I uh, almost finished this activity. Now it's been a pleasure to do this video for you. And remember, we're going to have a virtual meeting in Meet. So I'm going to send you through Tablon your uh, the information to get together. Okay? See you soon. Remember, stay home and don't go out. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.